So Steve, why don't you walk us through the numbers? Well, you see Jason Gavin as wild as opponent here. He took this fight on six times no. to be worrying about that. He needs to get rid of Gavin as quickly as he can. Both men are in the ring. Let's get the official introduction. Here's the always classic. Ladies and gentlemen from the StubHub Center in Carson Showtime, sponsored by Corona, La Cerveza Mas Fina, and AT&T mobilizing your world. Judges scoring this bout from ringside, all from Calix in the ring, and a special attraction scheduled for 10 rounds of boxing. My right fighting out of the red corner, wearing camouflage trunks, and hailing from Kissimmee, Florida. Introducing Jason Gabber. From Deontay Wilder. Mouthpiece? Mouthpiece? Sir? I gave you both instructions. Clean. Listen and obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. Good luck to both of you. Everybody out, please. His chin, the opposition he's faced thus far, but everyone who steps in the ring with him, he One says tonight, please. it's about looking sharp. He wants to fight Bermans to burn. Don't go to the refrigerator for Deontay Wilder. Here's a right hand by Gaffer. In great shape. He admitted it. He took it on six days' notice. He wants a quick fight, too. Stop. Separate, separate. Gavin is Wilder's former Box. sparring partner. From a distance, yeah. obviously, where Gavin can't hit him. If you want Wilder in the purple trunks, he throws another overhand right, Gavin does. And a right to the body as we get to the halfway point. He is chiseled. Philly. Again, he's a little heavy because he took this fight on such short notice. As you pointed out, he wanted to get some work in. With a right hand, all those factors. Wild right there. Right there. Stop punching, nobody punches. Then he started throwing a wild punch in. Keep him jabbing in the face, keep him moving. Sweep that back foot, right or left, and come in that direction, okay? And work your way up. You got it? This is round two. We're scheduled for ten. Show stat figure here, Brian Wilder connected with eight punches Got in the round notice. Two. First guy they called to bring in the spar. Then they brought in Demetrius King. A little gamesmanship because King, of course, has beaten Berman Stern. Exactly. And they admitted that. They admitted it was gamesmanship. Here's a one-two by Deontay Wilder. Tall guy looked to keep distance and land the big right hand. That's exactly what Wilder is all about. He keeps jabbing and moving a step or two to the side. Stop. Nobody punch. Separate. He said one thing he knows about Gavern from all their days of sparring is he watches his feet. Knows With his hands goes. down. But he's so big and tall and has such a long reach that when he takes a step or two back. Nobody. Jason Gavern, as Steve pointed out, took this fight on six days notice. Wilder says he wants to look sharp. What happens? This goes round. So we talked about his need to get rid of Gavin for obvious reasons. He doesn't want to blow the title fight, but thirty-one and zero in there that Wilder will face when he does fight for the title. Hopefully later this year against uh, Stevern. Right in by Gavin. They tried to nail down a fight, and they say they won it in November. Fight, Jason. That is it. He's particularly dominant now. Of course, it only takes one shot when you have Wilder's right hand power. But he's not been dominant thus far in this fight. By Gavin. Huge advantage for Wilder and Jeff. You expect it's entertaining. Did you see that? As Wilder hit him with an uppercut on the branch, he turns to the camera and says, Did you see that? <laughs> well, all you need to know they're based in Kissimmee, Florida. <laughs> There's a left hook by Gavin. Well, Jason Gavin should write a book one. He has utilized the jab for the most part in the third round. Here's the right hand by Wilder. And he calls a knockdown. Three, six, seven. And he's exactly right. If a fighter ducks his head and gets hit behind the head, well, it's the fighter's fault, not Deontay Wilder's fault. Time. 
Crowder ends the round with a jab. Give me water, give me water, get him away. Where is this, please? Gavin disputed. Watch Gavin bend his head, drop his head down. That's why he got hit. I guess it was behind him. Yeah, it looked like to the ear, the left ear of Gavin. <laughs> I know you're getting tired. I know you're getting tired. <laughs> That's not a good sign. No. And wouldn't that be ironic if in the fight that it's supposed to be the safest fight? Here's a right to the body by Gavin. Brian, you think there's a chance Wilder is perhaps not? He had that fighter meeting when he said, look, I, do, I really want to go more than four rounds. I want to get some work in tonight. I really thought he was just talking, but he has been in no rush at all here tonight. Represents. It's tough. It's tougher on, uh, on Wilder. People expect it to be. Another big right hand by Wilder. Three. Four. Player shot. But Jason Gavin, <laughs> he said, come on, baby, come back with the hook. <laughs> Gavin has now been down twice. I don't think Jason Gavin was thinking that he was going to win this fight. <laughs> Look, he's getting the biggest purse of his career tonight. Under a minute now. This is certainly an up by Wilder. I mean, what people expect a one-round knockout stop, stop, or a two-round knockout. He says, Gavin, is something wrong with you? He, he told him that, Jeffrey, so you got any oxygen? <laughs> Under 30 seconds. Stop, stop punching everybody, separate. Uh, Here's a right hand by Wilder. There have been opponents of Wilder who have been knocked out with, without much effort from Wilder. Malik Scott among them. Gavin's a legit tough guy. Push, but I need you to get up quick. You got pushed. Come here, crown's over. Just stop with the belt. Jack Reed, you heard him. He called that one a push. We don't. We don't. We don't. Stop. And you just heard stop Gavin it. say, "Stop the fight." So there you go. This one he had had enough. He, you, said, you talked about it. He took the fight. Nothing happened. He started getting pounded a little bit by That was it. This is round four, and Deontay Wilder still hasn't fought past four rounds. Right hand, little kick to me. I pretty much had enough. It's one thing to be tired and in a fight with an average fighter, but to be. Gavin getting shoved back by that jab. Wilder not real sharp tonight, though. Y'all make up y'all mind. What you want?